at Watson Greenhouse in Lafayette, co-owner Carol Watson says this year has been a lot different from last year. Last winter we had a lot of snow, which is good for plants. This year, no snow, up and down temperatures, very bad for plants. And as temperatures prepare to dip tonight, Watson's customers are stopping by, asking her for any advice she can give that will save their plants. We've had a lot of trimming to do and a lot of, you know, spraying and you know, a lot of time and money goes into that, so if they freeze, you lose what you put into it. Watson says it's supposed to be so cold tonight, she plans to take as many plants as possible inside. But for those plants that can't go inside, she has some advice. If it's in the ground, there's not much you can do. Cover it and hope for the best. If it's in a pot, bring it in. Watson says if you're covering your plants, make sure to cover them completely. Remay fabric works the best, but you can also use sheets. Just don't use plastic. And she says if the leaves on your plants turn brown, don't give up on them. With water and fertilizer, you may be able to nurse them back to health. If the cold weather continues, you can still start planting strong flowers like pansies. You may just want to put them outside during the day and bring them inside at night. We have to use our best judgment and, and help them along. They're depending on us. And by staying smart, gardeners may be able to help their plants through this crazy season. Jessica Kane reporting.